Hey everybody, it's Jason from Parafiles.net. Now, if there was something I could put more of on my channel, it would be investigations. I post a few from time to time that we've done, but unfortunately, I don't have many. There are a couple of reasons for this. The first is time. I work very long hours at my job, and I only have so many days off a year. Now, we've gone on several investigations, and I never did upload the footage to YouTube. Why haven't I? Well, that's the next reason. We don't get much evidence on those investigations. If I post a 30 minute video of an investigation we did and nothing happened, other than maybe one EVP, people aren't going to be likely to watch another one of our investigations. Also, if I post a 30 minute video and tell everyone up front, not much happens in this video, but watch anyway. Nobody's going to watch it. Our investigations aren't like the ones on TV. On those, when somebody investigates a place, they catch something very impressive every week. In real life, in my experience anyway, it doesn't work out like that. So I'm starting a new segment on my channel called Paranormal Grab Bag. This is where I plan on doing smaller videos. I thought I'd start this off with the spirit box session we did at the Walking Horse Hotel in Wartrace, Tennessee. Not much happened that night, but we did have one good spirit box session. Now, Tennessee is known for several things. World's Best Barbecue, Country Music, Moon Pies, Jack Daniels, and the birthplace of celebrities such as Aretha Franklin, Quentin Tarantino, Morgan Freeman, Dolly Parton, and Jack Hanna. And something most people probably don't know about are Tennessee walking horses. If you own and ride horses, they are a really big deal. The Walking Horse Hotel is a hotel on the National Registry of Historic Places. It was originally built in 1917 as a railroad hotel and was then named Hotel Orville. In the late 1930s, it was the base for a group of horse trainers who eventually created the Tennessee Walking Horse National Celebration an annual horse show held for the first time in 1939. Because of this, the name of the hotel was changed to the Walking Horse Hotel. The hotel is also known to be haunted, so our group went here a few years back in December of 2015. Like I said before, not much happened that night, but what I'm about to show you is something we call. In case you don't know, before I let you hear this clip, this is usually what the spirit box sounds like. What's your name? See, there's not a whole lot coming through. You ask questions and a bunch of annoying noise is usually all you get in return. So now, watch this. In five more days, do you know what day it will be? That sounded like Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. I'll play it again. In five more days, do you know what day it will be? That sounded like Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. Did you say Christmas? It is not like Christmas. Yeah. Oh, I want to make one. Do you like Christmas? I do. Did you get me anything for Christmas? me it really does sound like it answered my question and this video was filmed on December 20th five days before Christmas let me know what you guys think of this if you like it I'll post some more videos like this so that's all for today thanks for watching and remember there's no reason to be normal when you can be paranormal take care